I'm actually fitting into the clothes that I wore before I was pregnant with my first daughter. And even those clothes are actually a bit loose on me. Um, so I get to go shopping soon. <laughs> Having you and Derek part of this to motivate us, to keep us accountable for all of our decisions, like that, I couldn't be where I am now, like if I didn't go through this program. Hey everybody, Vanessa here. I've got Hope with me. Uh, she just wrapped up her first 12 week transformation. Super excited because she's sticking around long term, but we wanted to share her story and Hope is officially down 12 pounds. Her body has changed dramatically. You are nine months post pregnancy? Yep. Nine okay. Months. Yeah. So she, her body has gone through a major transformation. So we're super excited to get her story out there. So um, Hope, what motivated you to start training with Right to Fitness? So, I mean, like you said, I was, I just had a baby. I was nine months postpartum. Just going through those body transformations after I had her. I mean, obviously we have to kind of give ourselves some grace with having a baby and how our body looks afterwards. But I was just very unhappy about what I saw in the mirror. My self-esteem was really low and I just kept complaining about it. I just really hated how I looked. And my husband, Tyler, he just kept saying, well, if you don't like it, like, let's do something about it. Like, let's just not keep complaining. Like, let's make a change. Mm -hmm. So we decided um, that we this was going to be the year that we took the plunge, like put ourselves first. And here we are. I love it. Awesome. So have you previously tried anything else before working with Right to Fitness? I kind of tried like some HIIT workouts um, just with some like, exercises from a book that were like half an hour intervals. But I think what was lacking in that was just the um, motivation and like no one holding me accountable to do it. Like I would just keep coming up with excuses and just saying like, you know, I have a long day at work or I'm too tired. Like, so just things like that. So nothing ever really stuck. Were you enjoying the high intensity stuff or? Um, no, I mean, I did it because like, obviously I saw what those women look like and I'm like, okay, like I want to lose weight. And like, they, if they look like that, then I can look like that if I do it too. So I tried it and like, I didn't really like that type of workout. And I think that's another reason why it failed too, is because I didn't enjoy doing it. So how did you feel before starting your transformation program? Um, I was actually really nervous to start. Um, I mean, I've never done anything like this before. Um, it was Tyler's idea to uh, like find you guys. He went to school with Derek. Um, so, I mean, I was just nervous. I didn't really know what to anticipate. And I mean, obviously, like I said before, I didn't really like what I saw in the mirror. So like I just took the plunge and decided to do it. So what was your goal when starting out? I think my biggest goal was actually the nutrition side of it. Um, I mean, I always got tired of like most women coming up with dinner ideas at night and like whenever you don't really feel motivated to cook you kind of cook unhealthy things i never really felt that i made unhealthy like meals but finding like a set schedule like knowing what to have for like breakfast lunch and dinner in a healthy way that i could like keep going long term that was, I think, the biggest part of why I wanted to do this. I mean, obviously, I also wanted to lose weight and to look really good in a bathing suit. Um, so, I mean, that was the other motivating side of it. What results have you seen since you started Right to Fitness? Obviously, we know you're down 12 pounds, but any anything else? Um, I mean, my clothes have, like, fit dramatically different. Um, so, I'm actually fitting into the clothes that I wore before I was pregnant with my first daughter. And even those clothes are actually a bit loose on me. Um, so I get to go shopping soon. <laughs> but I mean, outside of that, I think my mood is overall better. Like, I like having a set schedule throughout the day. Like, I'm a very task-oriented person. So I like knowing, like, you know, I'm going to have breakfast. I'm going to log my meal. I'm going to, like, do some work, do my workout. Like, I really like having a plan for the day. And I think with this, it holds me accountable for making sure that I hit my goals. And then I think I'm just happier um, after I do my workouts, after I know that I'm making a healthy meal and I can see a difference in the mirror as well. So I think that's what keeps pushing me to do it. Yeah. That regimen every, you know, we, mm -hmm. we as humans, we flourish in routine. So it's awesome that this has kind of given you that routine. I love that. How do you feel now and how has your life changed? I mean, I feel great. Um, I mean, every time I, 
I get ready in the morning and I get changed and look in the mirror and I see like the change in my body. I mean, like I can start seeing my abs popping out. Like I feel like my love handles are like almost gone. It's just, it's dramatically different. And I mean, I feel like I'm just a happier person in general because of those changes. Now you're doing this with your husband, Tyler. Um, has that, um, affected your guys' relationship in any positive ways? Is this something you guys enjoy doing together? I actually, I think it's so much easier having a partner that does this with you. Um, I know as women, we kind of need a little bit more support and like we like like talking about like what we're going through. And I feel like men are just more of like, they like to solve the problems mm -hmm. instead of like talking about it. But doing this with him, um, it's actually held both of us more accountable for things. Like if we like are feeling really snacky and like if I want like cookies or something, he's like, no, like, let's not do that. Let's come up with like a different idea or mm -hmm. like for breakfast, like, you know, we just kind of motiv motivate each other to like make healthier options or even like the work outside of it. If like I'm having a bad day and like making excuses why I don't really feel like working out. Like he always pushes me in a, in a good way to be like, you know, like, like take 15 minutes, like just get out of your head and let's just go do it. Like yeah. I'll do it with you and let's just go do it. That's awesome. I love that. Okay. So what aspects of our coaching have you most enjoyed? I think I just like the accessibility. Um, like I know I've messaged you multiple times in the grocery store where I like see something. I'm like, oh, I wonder if this is a good option. So like I'll take a picture and I'll send it to you. And usually you get back to me before I leave the grocery store. Mm -hmm. And you're like, yeah, like you can do that, but in moderation or like this is a better alternative. Um, so I think that's really nice having like you and Derek, like right there, like able to give us the answers that we need. Um, but also the weekly calls that we have I know for your Monday calls, um, like all the ladies just kind of ask the same questions that like we've been thinking or that we have gone through. So it's kind of nice to know that we're not alone in thinking those questions. And I really look forward to Derek's Wednesday uh, motivation calls. Um, like I swear if he wasn't like a trainer, he could be a motivational speaker <laughs> okay. because he like gets me going. <laughs> Try being married to him. I'm like always <laughs> pumped up. <laughs> <laughs> or almost married to. <laughs> so just the overall support kind of on, on all fronts. Um, yes. So what new goals do you have now? So Tyler and I both actually just renewed for another 16 weeks with, with both of you. Um, so I think we're coming to the end of our weight loss journey part. And now we are going to be focusing more on continuing the nutrition um, and the eating part of it we really want to start targeting those areas like our midsection or like our hips or our glutes that, you know, we just really want to focus on and, and tighten. And so that's kind of where we're going and I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah. Super exciting for me too. So what would you tell anyone who is thinking about working with right to fitness? Um, I would just say go for it. I mean, Tyler and I, like, I feel like we've just made a lot of excuses in the past about like, no, we can do this by ourselves. Like neither of us have really been like overweight and we've always just been like healthy. I mean, you can kind of tell that we like tacos and margaritas, but we're not overweight either. Um, but I think like just having you and Derek, um, part of this to motivate us, to keep us accountable for all of our decisions, like that. I couldn't be where I am now, like if I didn't go through this program.